Hello, I'm Simon Miller, training captain with EasyJet. I'm here today at our flight training centre to show why airspace modernisation is the quickest and most cost-effective way to reduce carbon emissions. The advancement of flight navigation technology is such that we could be achieving significant emission reductions. The problem is that the airspace and navigational routes we use today have seen little development since their establishment in the 1950s. We used AI to analyse and model the carbon impact from airspace inefficiencies across all EasyJet flights over the past 12 months. Our results show EasyJet alone could achieve efficiency gains of over 10% just by modernising our airspace. These gains would help us dramatically reduce our fuel consumption and CO2 emissions, as well as flight times. Let's see how airspace modernisation could improve one of our typical routes. In this demonstration, the aircraft is flying inbound to Luton from Paris Charles de Gaulle under current airspace restrictions. We can see here that as the aircraft enters UK airspace, instead of flying directly into Luton, the aircraft is forced to fly past the airport and travel towards Cambridge, then further northwest before circling back. This extends the flight time by 16 minutes, burning an additional 600 kilos of fuel and releasing an additional 1.9 tonnes of CO2, all a result of current airspace restrictions. In our second demonstration, the aircraft is flying an optimised route without any airspace routing restrictions. In this scenario, the aircraft is able to fly a more direct route, reducing the additional 93 track miles which are currently required. The flight time for this journey is now 49 minutes, compared to 1 hour 5 minutes from the previous example. This is equivalent to a 20% reduction in fuel consumption and CO2 emissions. Based on our calculations, we estimate airspace modernisation could help eliminate 18 million tonnes of CO2 from European skies every year. We know the scale of what airspace reform could help us achieve. We now need to make it happen.